Good morning, people, and welcome to Stinky's Art Class, where we have the best students in the world. Today's lesson is how to draw a star. Okay, let's talk about something here. Now, class, I want to say the word, art history. Don't click off me yet. Just listen, hear me out. Let's talk about art history for a second with a star. You ever heard of the guy Van Gogh, Vincent? Vincent was a, a, a guy, I think he was probably drawing stars one day. And you may think, oh, stars, that's not a good art lesson. Stars are, you know, really tiny specks in the sky. And, you know, they're fun to look at, but just not fun to draw, right? Well, think about Vincent. He broke the barriers, you know. He, he was a square peg, and they tried to put him in a round hole, and it didn't work. You know, he decided he was going to draw the stars and he produced a masterpiece because of it. OK, so be open to my lessons because you never know. You may be inspired to go out and draw stars and or you may want to be a rebel and draw whatever rebels draw and, you know, be a, you know, start the revolution in art. You know, who knows? And. So draw the things that you want to, even if they seem uh, mundane. Is that a word? Okay, enough pep talk. Let's get into this lesson, okay? Stars are, you can do, let's do it kind of like the, the stars Van Gogh did for art lesson, okay? You can do stars with outlines. Yeah, you didn't know. Stinky was so talented, did you? That's a hard one. Okay, you can do... We're going to make this like a night. Like a starry night. Okay, you got stars like that. Okay, then you got... Um, stars like this. Fast ones. And you got shooting stars. And what you want to do is you just want to think about the stars do you like those better or do you like you know making them oh not every star has to be the same we're not all the same all of the students some students like to draw landscapes some students like to draw skulls some students like to draw frogs some students like to draw uh, people, you know, in cartoons, like every student is different, just like all these stars are looking different, especially this one. This one may be the revolution star, you know, uh, a new, I'm not talking about government revolution. I don't want to be kicked off everything, but I'm talking about artistic revolution, breaking the, the status quo on color on shape, on geometric form. That's what I'm talking about, starting a revolution, people. On beautiful beauty. And I guess if we're going to talk about beauty, we need to talk about ugly, too. It's okay. We, ugly, is, ugly is good. Beauty is good. Okay? See this little star? It's different. I think, you know, if if old Vincent was here today and he was attending class, I think he would be, uh, he would like some of these stars. He'd probably, he'd probably be appreciating this. Okay? He would like to see all of this, right? He likes, he would like all these stars. That one's going the opposite way. Okay, so I, I'm kind of drawing a blank here on, um, you know, stars, but you can do them four points, five points, six points, you know, big stars. There's lots of ways to do stars. And, um, Okay, I don't want to get too corny in class, but, you know, my students are my stars, you know, they're, 
y'all are all stars, I could say. Y'all are the all stars, the, the MVPs, you know. If it wasn't for my students, this class would be nothing. So I appreciate the students. I think you're all stars in uh, your own way, just like this star, I did the wrong geometric line and it, but that star is, uh, it's standing out, isn't it? Which star stands out to you? Is there a star that, you know, maybe you connect with? All right, enough deep thought. Let's get back to reality. Okay. All right, class, get ready for more epic art lessons. Uh, and Sticky's art class. Have a great day and we'll see you at the next lesson. Class dismissed.